So today I'm going to insert Excel decode into the SQL Server table and the SQL database table. So basically, I have a table name TBL employees. So I'm going to copy the column name of this table. Okay. So I'm going to paste this data form here. Now we have a employee ID. So I don't need this one because it's a auto incremented ID. So I'm going to delete also this row. Okay now i'm going to okay now i'm going to uh, copy some data from here actually i have already data actually i don't wanna waste your time so going to copy and paste the data here okay then now i'm going to write some query just like we write in the sql server okay like insert into table we have a tbl underscore employee table name employees okay I'm going to things this okay i have a first name so uh, if i have first name comma last name comma phone comma email comma date of birth address city state country postcode okay Close things is values okay now they will use you okay that's fine now okay okay now I'm going to use the query just like we write okay in the next row here so going to the concatenate here I will use concatenate Continued. what I'm going to do continue these things comma okay double quotes single quote double quote okay and comma I'm going to copy this thing okay and comma double quote single double comma double comma double comma double single double comma last name comma double quotes single double comma double quotes comma double quotes comma double single double and comma phone number comma double okay co double single double comma double comma double comma double single double and comma address comma double single double comma double comma double comma double quotes single quotes double quotes comma date of birth comma double single so uh, we will use for the date of birth text okay and column okay the format of date y y y m m dd double quotes close it close it comma double quotes single double comma double comma double quotes comma double quotes single quotes double quotes comma we have an address T 
state country was good and there is some error here let's see what I am missing okay so basically I have missed here okay yeah I have missed the comma here okay there is a comma if the enter done okay now I am going to drag drag and drop this column here done and now i'm going to drag and drop this column here done now what i'm going to do here select this column let me agree this column okay and this one also okay now what i'm going to do copy this column and paste it into the sql server query window paste here let's see what we have mistaken here does we have okay let's see okay i think everything fine let's see and execute it press f5 or execute button click on execute button okay now let's see yeah so basically there are five row affected and what how many row we have i think this one also we have five rows right so basically these are inserted into the SQL server here you can check it by selecting the using this query and now check it out here yeah. 104105 this is the auto incremented email employees ID ok as I said so these are the first name last name ok so it's almost inserted into the SQL server table then so yeah i'm going to show you one thing so you can see the clearly okay okay these things we have here okay i'm going to show these things from here okay so that you can see it okay hold on just a second okay this is the things I'm going to copy it and I will show you in the notepad. Let's see how it will look like. Yeah, it will look like like this. Right. Okay. So basically we will use single quotes and double quotes and then in the mid is single then double. Okay. For the string values basically we are using this. And again what we are doing single uh, so the double then single quotes then double quotes okay and comma and again for the comma we are using double quotes and comma and then again the double quotes here so these are the query and yeah so this one will work perfectly for you if you have a lot of data in the excel then definitely yeah, it will work good for you and it's easy to use as a query okay guys i hope you like this video thanks for watching and bye bye see you see you soon again